exactly what she wanted to do and that's my favorite memory of her just uh, just embodying who she is and knowing what she wanted to do from day one and make sure that you always make good choices and continue to be who you are don't change I wasn't really too good in geometry so me and Rachel we were partners and every day she was slipping her answers to geometry thank you for my A First thing that came to my mind when we lived in Illinois, Rachel and Daniel would come visit us at the big house, right? Daniel would always irritate Rachel. And the only thing I remember, Rachel, at that time when she was young, she cried all the time. Stop Daniel, stop Daniel. Uh, and she would have these long spells of crying. And Daniel would have a way of agitating her and we didn't know it. And I was wondering why she was crying just continuously. Daniel would have a way of ir Am I right, Rachel? Yes, she, don't remember. she don't remember. Well, I'm grandma, but she would cry all kinds. Am I like her? Yes, you are. All the time. That's what I remember about her. And the other thing is, Rachel has grown up to be, to me, very intelligent yes. and very smart. I can't get my phone to working, Rachel. Can't get the computer going, Rachel. Continue, honey, because I got my eyes on you. Okay. And I don't have a favorite memory. Um, all the memories are wonderful, and I agree with Grandma. You have grown to be a mature woman. As Grandmother says, be true to yourself. And as Grandfather says, continue to trust God. And you will go very far. I love you. I love you. I love you. Thank you. Strike. And it's mine. 
Yeah. Well, like my sister said, um, sometimes me, Mr. Dan, Rachel, and Daniel would play volleyball in the backyard. And we have a hill, like uh, ain't a decline. So one time, I think it was me or Daniel who hit the ball down the hill. And I, I saw Rachel try to run and get it, but she tripped and fell. <laughs> so, that's my favorite memory. I met Rachel about five or six years ago. And um, Rachel has become my assistant. Only person I let touch my paperwork, my the money while I'm away. Um, I do a lot of stuff for her dad. And I knew when um, last week, a we, few weeks ago, we had a Nike South Beach tournament and they were just grabbing papers and jerseys. We had about 100 kids. Rachel come right back there, she said, I got you. I ain't gotta tell her what to do. She learned from the best, Aww. I had to say. But um, she's gonna be a wonderful, wonderful 16-year-old daughter. I know her daddy loves her a lot. She is treasured by her entire family and I just wanna say, I'm so happy you're having a great birthday and I'm glad you came into my life. Um, and you like a dark Since you were born with blue eyes, you allowed me to learn how to love in a different way. And because, <laughs> um, Can you take me? Come on, <laughs> and not really learning and knowing how to love. You allowed me to love in a different way. Um, everywhere that I went, you held my hand. Actually, you held my pinky. And we would walk everywhere. I would walk Rachie around the block, talking to her. And all the only thing she wanted to do was be picked up. So she would always say, I want up, I want up, pick me up, I want up. Well, I want a nap, I want a nap. So she loved to sleep. Anybody that know her knows she loved to sleep. So that was her favorite word was, I want a nap, I want a nap. And as she started to mature a little bit, you, everything that you've heard, Rachel, in how to be a young lady, you possess those attributes and those qualities. Do not change. As you know, I have fought for you for years, you and Daniel. And anybody that knows me knows how much I love my kids. And so, as a father, all I expect is the best. You have a lot to offer. A lot to offer. So these people that are around here today, it's not because you're pretty, it's not because you're cute, it's not because you're even beautiful. It's because you possess something that allows people to be attracted to you outside of aesthetics. You have a heart full of gold. So daddy loves you. I will always love you. Don't take advantage of daddy. But you know that daddy has your back.